Hello friends, in today's video I have nine, <laughs> possibly 10, birthday party ideas for adults that are great for social distancing in person. I know, times are confusing right now, aren't they? We are at the tail end of a pandemic. Some people are still meeting virtual, other people are gathering in person again. If we are meeting for the first time, hi, my name is Sean. Welcome on this channel. I am passionate about having fun with my family and my friends. All right, let's jump into today's ideas. Here we go. The first adult birthday party idea is a stock the bar birthday parade. A drop off liquors, wines, adult beverages, and a fancy birthday party parade where people decorate their cars, yell out the window, blow party horns, wear a party hat at the birthday person's house. This idea also works well if you are meeting with your family and friends at home and you don't need to do a drive-by. <laughs> you can just stock their bar. The second birthday party idea are the yard letter birthday signs. These are great to just surprise the birthday person. <laughs> I did this for my husband last year when the pandemic first hit. We did these cute little bunny yard signs in our front yard so that everybody could see that he was old. Gray hairs, uh, nice. I mean, there's just a few gray hairs. I say he's old, but I'm actually three months older than he is, so. I'm allowed to say that. Idea number three is a potluck birthday meal. Coordinate with your family and friends the different dishes that everybody will drop off. So you don't want, you know, three people dropping off rolls <laughs> for the birthday party. Have a couple side dishes, have some bread, have some wine, have some cheese, have some cake. Make sure everybody knows what they're dropping off and deliver it all to the birthday person's front porch in a very cute, adorable picnic basket so that they can enjoy their birthday in style and not have to cook. That's the best thing about it. You don't have to cook. The next birthday idea is a virtual game night. You all know if you've watched any of my other videos how much I love a game night and virtual game nights have been all the rage this past year. So hop on Zoom. I know some of you are tired of Zoom, but a lot of fun can still be had online. This way you can see friends across the country, across the world, invite those people that wouldn't normally be able to show up to your house for a virtual party. And I'm gonna leave a link to a playlist of awesome Zoom game ideas for adults in the description box down below. Yes, I have some videos dedicated specifically for Zoom games for adults that you're gonna wanna watch. The next idea is to spend the night in a tree house. Okay, hear me out. <laughs> I'm not talking about your kid's tree house that's all, you know, hammered <laughs> and sloppily onto a tree in your backyard. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about a luxury tree house. My family and I did this a couple of years ago and it was fantastic. It was out in the woods. We had all the luxuries, we had a refrigerator, we had a bathroom, but it was in a tiny little tree house up in the trees. And it was just a perfect little getaway. I'll link to that video where you can see where we spent 24 hours in this tree house. I'll link it in the description box down below. The next birthday idea is to visit your local drive-in theater. Now, we just moved to the current town where we are in in South Carolina, and I've heard there's a drive-in theater somewhere, somewhere around here that we haven't been to yet. So this is on my bucket list of things to do. But it's a great way to get together with your family and your friends and practice social distancing if you are still doing that from the safety of your car, but watch the newest movies. This next birthday idea involves the birthday person's favorite restaurant. So find out, find out what their favorite restaurant is Go pick up to go and have a picnic. We're getting into spring here in the United States and especially in South Carolina and the grass is opening up. It's the perfect time to host a socially distanced picnic outside. You have a ton of people. I'm talking 50 to 100 people. Everybody gets their own blanket. You spread outside. Everybody brings their own restaurant food and eats their own food outside. It works great for just your immediate family as well as hundreds of people. Elevated outdoor movie party. The keyword here is elevated. I'm not talking about hanging up a sheet on the back of your garage door, popping some popcorn, pulling out those uh, lawn chairs or those bee chairs and inviting everybody over for an outdoor movie night. Although that is how to do it on a budget. This is the bougie
bougie version. Set up a projector, rent an inflatable screen or purchase one off of Amazon, buy soft pillows, have a little buffet table, set out rugs, just lots of, think, cozy textiles and fabrics, light some outdoor candles, string up some lights, use milk crates as mini tables, and create a signature cocktail drink for your elevated movie party <laughs> so that everybody can watch a movie at your house and have a fancy cocktail at the same time. Before I talk about my very last birthday party idea, I'd love for you to consider subscribing to my channel. I post new ideas for celebrating and having fun with your friends and family every single week. Let's talk charcuterie boards. Did I say that right? Charcuterie boards? Does it have does it have the word toot in the middle? Charcuterie boards? Is it more like a chew sound or a toot sound? <laughs> I thought I knew how to say this word, and now that it's coming out of my mouth, I don't know how to say this word. Cheese board. Fancy cheese board and appetizers. Send one of these, one of these right here. <laughs> To the birthday person, I've seen so many of these fancy locally made in my areas that are being advertised on the local community Facebook boards, Facebook groups. That would be the perfect way to spoil the birthday man or woman in your life. Stock it up with a wine basket on their porch, have everyone pitch in for the cost of the board, and ask each person to drop off a bottle of wine in the basket on their front porch. And then for a personal touch, have everybody sign a card. So leave a card in the basket, have everybody sign it as they drop off their wine to go with your fancy charcuterie board. <laughs> I know I'm saying that wrong. I'm saying that wrong. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you in my next one. <laughs>